hello welcome to z2k again so today my topics how to set up or install whmcs on hosting server part 2 so my download just complete right now you can see this file if i don't if we don't see this file just click on refresh then we will see that so now i need to extract it just click and just take some minute and you can see this is in a folder so that's why I go to this folder and select all and drag them into public html and then you need to go your hosting domain so I just already go there and you can see this warning or this welcome note uh, you need to install so click on to Bing and read this agreement carefully after reading you th if you think the agreement right for you then click I agar and there you can see you need to config file so I can I see this config file and there but you need to rename that so I am just rename and remove dot name S but sometime you don't need to do that ok so check again so everything is ok right now so just click continue and now you need license key you can't access your license key from this link and after going to this link you need to login or some hosting provider gives you license key so talk your talk with your hosting provider so um come to next step uh, database connection details so you need to create at first one database so go to control panel home panel home and then my SQL database and create one so like that what ever what you want so create one database and then you need to create database user and generate password and copy that I have copy and create password you can save this copy password ok and also enter there and after creating database and database user you need to add user to database click add check all make changes then go and now just copy the database name and database username but you can see there my database name and my username are both are same name so that's why I'm just copy and paste copy and paste so I'm um, for security reason I'm pausing that step because and now I'm enter my license key but I can't show you that so just a few minutes so after enter my license key I'm just click continue So the next step you can see there uh, admin setup account just enter your name your email id your username your password your confirm password so security reason I can't show you that also so I'm sorry so I'm just pausing that step again so now so now my I enter all details and just click complete setup 
sometimes it takes some few minutes for completing that step this is the last step of installing so I'm pausing this few minutes so this step is complete right now so uh, now I have just three tasks the so first one delete install folder uh, select install folder and delete and second tax some read some documentary from there so I don't need that right now and set up three create a con just copy this link and go to admin panel home and then con jobs and then paste that comment and time when the con job will be run so I'm choosing once per day you can choose this one per day but I'm choosing per week okay so it's depending on you but I'm recommend you choosing per day okay my con job setup is done and now I I can log in into my admin panel and also I can visit this site right now now you can see my WHM setup is full complete so I'm entering details so then login you can see this dashboard of WHM now this tutorial of setup is complete now you can see more videos for setup payments product server etc so thanks for watching this video hope you like this video then thumbs up and subscribe us